Hello people, just want to show you some new upgrades that we just did to the uh, Traxxas Stampede 4x4, non-VXL, but does have a brushless motor in it. We uh, put the new sway bar links in there, uh, one's right there, attaches down at the bottom of each control arm, and the innermost hole closest to the chassis, and same with the front. Now, the only thing I don't like about this particular setup is the two screws that hold the uh, shock protector in there uh, you lose the outer one and you only keep the inner one so now it's only held on by one screw which also holds the shock in not too happy with that idea but there's got to be a way to change that maybe get a uh, better screw a better spacer or run it through the link itself and then maybe reconnect that in there um, wheelie bar, obviously, just got in today, came in, put that on, tire of this thing flipping every time you accelerate, even at high speed, you hit the throttle, still wants to flip itself over, but I guess that's all due to the, uh, three cell and the, the monster motor there, and, uh, second thing is, we're talking to a few people, and they said that, um, in the process of bashing their trucks, they keep damaging the steering servo, or the steering, hardware down in there and uh, the steering gear I don't know if you can see it down in there I'm sure you know what it looks like but there it is down in there so we went to the machine shop yesterday and we machined a piece of aluminum that runs down the length of the bottom of the chassis and you can see it guards the uh, steering servo and the hardware in there so no need to uh, worry about bashing that up when you're jumping over rocks and stuff uh, it's pretty cool Built three of them just in case I bend one or two. Got more on backup. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye.